Let's prepare our bedroom for the baby that's about to come out of my undercarriage. We do some new sheets, a perfect timing. Wash your bed sheets, don't be gross. I've turned into a linen bedding lover. These ones are from Piglet in Bed. I don't quite know how the Kyle ended up with so much space on his side. But we had to move the bed over so that I could get the cot next to me. Because let's be for fucking real, he ain't doing it. This is the fourth baby that's going to be using this cot. All of my children, also my best friend Helen used it for her little boy. It's a co-sleeper bassinet called Arms Reach. Still got the moving tag on it. Anchor it underneath your mattress to your bed so that you don't boot it away in your sleep. And then one of the sides comes down so you can reach the baby easily. If he's a bit bigger than she was before. Then Charlie wants a little turn that he's got bigger too oh my god i miss my old big bedroom maybe he doesn't have a room so a lot of its clothes will be kept in here as well the caddy put things like nappies wipes lotions guys i actually can't believe i put this bedding on by myself just too excited to get it on because look how beautiful it is call me crazy but i actually love the newborn stage it's actually my favorite so i'm so excited to have a new baby i did though have postpartum depression with my son so i'm really just trying to stay positive hoping that i'm already having a different experience